This is Adam English on Union Jack Radio. And uh, well, we love speaking to people who are doing amazing things to help during the coronavirus crisis. So let's speak now to Alice from Oxfordshire. Hello, Alice. Hi, Alice. How are you? Oh, you sound very chipper. How, how are you doing during lockdown? <laughs> Uh, yeah, we're all right, actually, yeah. Good, good. Um, so you, you've been doing something quite amazing with your time uh, during all this, haven't you? Do you want to tell us tell us about it? Yeah, sure. So um, I work at Warrington School in Oxfordshire, and we have a laser cutter. Um, so we've been doing some fundraising, uh, and we are now making face shields for the local community and the care homes and the hospitals in our area. That's amazing. So, so, you're, so you're using the laser cutter from the school... To, to make these uh, face shields. Is that something you've ever done before or did you have to learn how to make face shields? How, how did you come about doing this? So um, one of my colleagues, Jackie, found it on uh, the internet and she forwarded me the drawings and I changed it so we could use it on our machine and our software. Oh, that's genius, um, and isn't then, it? Yeah. <laughs> so it's, it's pretty simple once you know how to do it. <laughs> and so you've been, you've been donating them to, to local hospitals and, and stuff? Yeah, so um, we've raised about 4,300. Um, we've made 450 masks already. Wow. Um, we've gone to local care homes, Wanneket Hospital, a couple of were sent to Bristol. Um, and we've still got some orders for Wexham Hospital, uh, Berkshire, Watlington, places like that. That's so, amazing. <laughs> you mu- you sa- it sounds like you must be flat out doing this then. Yeah, it's pretty much, I mean, we can cut six every 11 minutes so you know it's kind of a constant wow. thing we have to keep pressing the button and everything <laughs> well it's, it's, it's people like you who have the resources and have the kind of uh, knowledge and, and know how how to do this kind of stuff um we need more people like you to to be heroes and, and do this kind of stuff yeah i mean it's easy once you know you have the machinery and you can get into school and everything and there's the dt team is kind of chipping in where they can to help out and distribute and stuff like that so um it makes it quite easy once you get into a routine. <laughs> and and Alice, where can uh, where can people find uh, you if they wanna if they wanna donate to this cause and, and help you out with that? So on Facebook there is an NHS um, and frontline PPE fundraiser online. Um, it's been shared by Wallingford School, so that's quite a good way to get through to it. Lovely stuff. And uh, finally, Alice, uh, you're on national radio here. So would you like to say anything now to any NHS staff or key workers that, that might be listening in? Um, just keep up the really good work. Obviously, we're here to support and we are grateful for everything that you are doing. Um, and hopefully this will all be over soon. Oh, beautiful stuff. Alice, thank you very much. You are a hero.